Today I'm gonna to give you my first impressions of this merino wool t-shirt by Outliers. <music> Greetings YouTube from New York City. My name is Kevin. I make these weekly videos documenting my journey towards full-time travel. If that type of content interests you, please subscribe below. So I have five Merino t-shirts that I plan on bringing with me when I begin traveling around the world. I have two by Wooly, which I've already done a first impressions video about, and I have two by Unbound Merino, which I've also done a first impressions video about. This video is my first impression of this blue outlier Merino wool t-shirt. This t-shirt is one of the most expensive Merino wool t-shirts out there. The two Wooly shirts I talked about are under $50. The Unbound Merino shirt is about $65 but this outlier is actually $110. Outlier's claim to fame is that they're not gonna reinvent the wheel in style. They're gonna take classic styles and make them with really good material. This shirt is 195 GSM. GSM stands for grams per square meter. In the world of Merino wool, a premium Merino wool fabric is between 160 and 200 GSM. This shirt falls at the top end of that range it's one of the most premium merino wool t-shirts you'll find out there. Outlier makes shirts in multiple different GSM counts. They actually have a workout shirt that has a lower GSM count, so the fabric is a little bit lighter. That's an option most merino wool t-shirt companies don't have. The cut and the fit are phenomenal. I'm 5'11", 165, and this is a medium shirt. It fits me the way I expect a medium t-shirt to fit me. On Outlier's website, they recommend that you hand wash this t-shirt. However, they put a little caveat in there and they reveal that most of the people that work in their company actually wash and dry this, but they said expect to lose about a half a size. So if you're one of those people like me that's somewhere between a small and a medium, maybe that's a good thing. However, the whole point of Merino wool t-shirts for me is so when I'm on the road, I can actually hand wash them. So I haven't put this shirt in a washer and dryer or any of my Merino shirts actually other than one of my woolly shirts which my mother grabbed and washed when I was visiting her. This shirt comes in multiple different colors which is great because a lot of merino wool t-shirt companies only have a very limited amount of colors. Outlier has more colors than most places. I personally wasn't really sure about this color because I normally wear darker grays and blacks but I actually really like it. And even though it cost me more than my two woolly shirts put together, I'm actually really happy with this purchase. So now I've done first impression videos on all five of my Merino wool shirts. My plan is to review them about every three to six months and let you know how they're holding up. If you own some Merino shirts and have a favorite, please comment down below what your favorite Merino shirt is. If you like this video, please like down below. And if you're interested in the follow-up videos or watching me transition from working a nine to five to traveling full-time, please go ahead and click that subscribe button down below. Thanks for watching.